It was so wonderful for me to hear your story. May God continually watch over you and bless you. Have you accepted Jesus Christ as your personal Lord and Savior? Yes, I have accepted you. It's our privilege to baptize you in the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Here we go, bang my knees. Oh. <laughs> to see you go public with your faith and uh, make a commitment from this time forward mm -hmm. and make it about Jesus, I believe it's the most awesome thing. And so thank you for letting me be part of this day. Yeah. So have you accepted Jesus Christ as your personal Lord and Savior? Yes, I have. Well, then it's our privilege to baptize you in the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Amen. Pray that only God goes with you going forward. Yes. And that you will continually hang on to him through the journeys of your life. Okay. And so, have you accepted Jesus Christ as your personal Lord and Savior? Yes, I have. Here we go. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Amen. It's a beautiful thing. Just to be, not only you and our family, but the privilege to be able to baptize you on a, such a special day as today. So, have you accepted Jesus Christ as your personal Lord and Savior? Yes. Based upon your profession of faith, it's a privilege for us to baptize you in the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Amen. <laughs> I'm so excited to see him get baptized here in Africa. We've also invited the tribe, they're all warriors, to witness it and uh, to be part of going forward. Do you choose Jesus? Have you accepted Jesus as your personal Lord and Savior? Yes. Then based upon your profession of faith, it's an honor and privilege to baptize you here in Africa with such a great audience in the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Thank <laughs> you.